Hello everybody and welcome to your daily messages from Spirit on Crossing the Spiritual Streams. My name is Tandra and we do have our three piles that you can choose from. We have pile one with the Chalcedony Stone. We have pile two with the Citrine Stone and then pile three with the Carnelian Stone. So you've got your three piles here to choose from. We also have our Oracle Sphere so you can be thinking of a yes or no question question that you can get an answer to and we will be going out and getting those here in just a moment uh, for each reading. So we're going to give you some time to reflect on these piles. But right before we do that, I just would love to say thank you to everybody who has subscribed to the channel. Left us comments in the comment section. Give us thumbs up on all the videos that you've watched and that has shared the channel with your friends and family. We do have our unique URL. It is listed in the description. You can copy and paste it over. You can text it, email it, put it out on your social media accounts and give your friends and family a chance to check out the channel as well. And we really appreciate all of you who have done that for us and are going to do that for us. Okay, so we're gonna give you some time to reflect on these piles. When you have decided which pile is the best one for you to go to, there will be a link in the description and you can go directly to your pile and we'll see you there. Hello, Pile One. Welcome to your daily messages from Spirit. Those of you that chose the Chalcedony Stone here, we're going to move that over. We've got your daily messages plus your Oracle Spheres, so don't forget to be thinking of your yes or no question that you can get an answer to. So let's see what Spirit has to say for us today. We got the Six of Cups, we got the Hierophant, and the Judgment card. Okay, the message I'm getting is, I feel like you guys have almost reverted back to childhood thoughts and memories. Basically, there's some something going on in your life right now that is making you feel young but not necessarily in a good way just almost that like you have like authority figures like deciding things for you or looking out over your life or in some way controlling you and so you kind of feel almost like a little kid again in that you, you kind of feel a little bit powerless slightly in that or they make you feel a little bit like you, you I don't know if you guys, the, the feeling I'm kind of getting, it's, it's kind of jumbled here, but it's a distinctive feeling that a lot of children feel in that when you're a child and you're looked down upon by adults in your life, or they say things to you that make you feel kind of bad or small about yourself, or like, um, because you don't know something or because you didn't do it quite the way they think it should be done or other types of feelings like that, that there's something going on in your life right now that's making you feel that way, okay? And the message that Spirit has for you is that don't let what other people say or do make you feel less than because their opinions are their opinions. Their opinions are for what they want to think about life or what they want to do or how they do things. Don't let that affect, you know, if you've done something and you're happy with it or you're proud with it or, or you've done it the way that makes you happy or the way you feel about it, don't let what other people say about it make you feel bad or make you think maybe I shouldn't have done it that way or maybe it should be done differently or other things. Spirit doesn't want you to feel belittled or less than um, just because other people have different thoughts and feelings or opinions on things that you've done. Okay, that's the message they want to get out to you. Please, please, please don't let 
other people make you feel that way because your thoughts, feelings, and actions are valid for you. Okay, and that's something Spirit really wants to get out there to you, really wants you to understand that, you know, just because other people have thoughts and opinions, you know, that that's, that's for their life. That's not for yours. Okay, and that, you know, there's no need for you to feel that, that way. Okay, all right, so we do have our Oracle Spheres here. We have blue, green, and purple today. You decide which stand you'd like to get your answer on. You think of a yes or no question, and then we'll go out and we'll get our answers. Number one, blue is a not likely. Number two, greens, and also not likely. Oh, wow. This rarely happens. Number three, purple, is a not likely. I always wonder what kind of questions you guys are asking when the answers are all the same or very similar. So all three stands, blue, green, and purple, are not likely today. So there's your orcosphere answers. All right, guys. Please remember to give the video a thumbs up. Share the channel with your friends and family. Check out our other videos on the channel. We have lots of timeless tarot on lots of different topics, and there might be one or two or three out there of use to you. They are more in-depth than these daily readings are, so uh, you know, go check those out. We do put out these videos every single day. We also put out other videos at least once a week. So we look forward to seeing you in those videos, and may the stars guide your path. Bye-bye. Hello, Pal 2. Welcome to your daily messages from Spirit. Those of you that chose the Citrine Stone, we'll move that over here. We do have your daily messages here as well as your Oracle Spheres. So we're remembering to think of your yes or no type of question that you get your answer to. Let's see what Spirit has to say today. We've got the Five of Swords, the Two of Pentacles, and the Chariot card. Okay. You guys... It's very similar to some messages we had this week on movement is starting to happen in your life. And there could have been a conflict that you guys had or some decision to make or something like that going on for you guys. And that should break free relatively soon and some movement should start happening in it. Either you're finally going to be able to make the decision you need to make or you're going to uh, come out uh, victorious in a conflict that, you, that you've had uh, and, and you're going to be able to move on and pass that. Uh, that's the energy. It's almost the exact same message as in another reading this week. It might have even been yesterday. I can't remember. Um, I just remember that energy came up in a reading. And it's almost the exact same message. So... Uh, maybe, so I guess it hadn't happened yet, but, but the spirits still want you to know that it's, it's coming. It's, it's soon that, that, that is going to break free relatively soon and movement's going to start happening. Things are, you're going to be able to move on. Things are going to be able to move forward in, in that situation. And you'll know whether it's the conflict or whether or not it's, um, a decision you've been trying to make or whatever, you'll know which, because you're, you're in that energy um, at the no, at the moment, so you'll know what it what it pertains to. All right, let's go on to our oracle spheres. We have blue, green, and purple. So we have three different stands here for you to choose from. You pick which stand you'd like to get your answer on. You think of your yes or no question, and we go out and we get it. Our answers. All right, the number one blue is a yes. Number three, green, is a very likely. And then a number three, purple, is a not likely. So number one, blue, is a yes. Number two, green, is a very likely. And a number three, purple, is a not likely. So there's your oracles for your answers for today's reading. Please remember to give the video a thumbs up. Share the channel with your friends and family. Do check out our other videos on the channel. We have lots of timeless tarot readings on lots of different topics, and there's bound to be some out there that would be of interest to you. We also do put out those videos at least once a week, and we put these videos out every day, so we do look forward to seeing you in future videos. And may the stars guide your path. Bye-bye.
Hello, Pile 3. Welcome to your daily messages from Spirit. Those of you that chose the Carnelian Stone here, we'll move that over here. We have your daily messages as well as your Oracle Spheres. So be remembering to think of a yes or no question that you can get an answer to because we're going to go out and get those. All right, let's see what Spirit has to say for us today. We have the Seven of Swords. We have the Ace of Swords and the Wheel of Fortune. Wow. Okay. You guys have some fortunate events and actions that are going to break your way, that are going to work out well in your favor, okay? It's very probable and possible that you guys are going to have some really good ideas come to you soon, that you're going to be able to... Um, like, like if it's in a work situation, let's give an example here. If, like if it's in a work situation, you're going to be able to come up with a good idea sooner than your coworkers. And so you're going to be able to make a leap ahead of them, or you're going to find a way to get things done at work, um, more efficiently or better. And so that's going to kind of put you a step ahead of other people or, you know, things like that. You're going to have that kind of energy. In something in your life and it could be at work it could just be um, you know in relationships but basically you have some really good ideas coming they're gonna kind of put you a step ahead of other people it's gonna put you in really good stead it's going to work out really well in your favor it's um, you know going to help you progress um, along and things work out well for you so that's coming up really soon so Spirit wanted you to know that, that, you know, you have some really good ideas. Um, it's even possible you've had some ideas and you're going to start being able to implement those soon. Um, and Spirit's just letting you know that now is the time to do that, that kind of energy, okay? So that sounds pretty cool and exciting. So I hope you guys have some awesome things happening for you there. All right. We have the um, three different stands here for you to choose from for your oracle spheres. We have purple, green, and blue today. You decide which stand you'd like to get your answer on. We go out and get your um, answers. You think of your yes or no question. And then we'll go out and here we go. All right. So the number one purple is not now. Number two greens are not likely. <laughs> and a number three blue is a yes. All right, so number one purple is a not now. Number two greens are not likely. And a number three blue is a yes. Thank you so much for being here for the reading. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. Leave us comments in the comment section. Share the channel with your friends and family. And subscribe if you haven't already done so. Also, please check out our other videos on the channel. We have lots of timeless tarot readings on lots of different topics, and there's bound to be some out there that might be of interest to you. We do put out these daily videos every day, as well as those other videos at least once a week. So we look forward to seeing you again. May the stars guide your path. Bye-bye.